Hi, I'm Dr. Kohler here in Fairhope, Alabama. And uh, one of the procedures we commonly perform is called a body lift or belt lipectomy. Uh, and this is a procedure that's done uh, particularly for patients who've lost a significant amount of weight uh, and then want to get rid of the loose skin and have an improved contour. Uh, this particular procedure does carry a slightly increased risk compared to a lot of other body contouring surgeries. And because of that, um, I think it's very important to do this procedure in the hospital setting. Although we do a lot of procedures in our office, this is a procedure that we do in the hospital. Uh, part of the reason for that is that these patients, because they have a history of being obese, uh, may have uh, increased uh, comorbidities such as diabetes or hypertension that could put them at increased risk for things like blood clots, infection, wound breakdown, and uh, other risks. So we do this in the hospital and there are several things that we do to uh, enhance the, the patient safety from a procedure like this. Uh, one is we do what's called an enhanced recovery after surgery protocol, which is uh, a cocktail of medicines that we give patients so that we can reduce their narcotic exposure, get them up and walking more quickly after surgery, and also get them out of the hospital more quickly. Uh, also, we take special precautions such as uh, warming the patients prior to surgery and during surgery to ensure that uh, they don't get cool in the surgery, which can also put patients at increased risk for infections and blood clots. Um, so we put special warmers on the patients. We give them heated IV fluids during surgery. Um, another issue is the blood loss. This is a long operation, depending on what all is being done. It can take anywhere from four to six hours or sometimes even a little longer than that. And so there can be some blood loss associated with this. Uh, to avoid needing blood transfusions, uh, we administer certain medications at the time of surgery to help limit the patient's blood loss. Um, afterwards, uh, these patients were kept in a hospital setting so that they can be monitored by the nurses, make sure that they're getting up and properly moving and also so we can get them out of the hospital as quickly as possible. Uh, overall, this procedure is a very safe operation, provided that we've taken the time to uh, take all these special precautions and also to make sure that uh, the patients are optimized for surgery. So even the things we do before we even make the decision to do surgery, making sure their heart is good, their lungs are good, um, will ensure that the patients have a safe experience. So thank you very much, and if you want to learn more about body lifts, check us out.